first trick first of all you have to learn the dance moves and in order to learn the dance moves you just have to follow four simple steps in the first step we are going to move our right foot forward twist our body and left foot will be in the air let me show you how to do that right foot forward twisting your body left foot in the air let me show you how to do it again we move our right foot forward twisting our body left foot in the air in the second step we are going to do the same but we'll move our right foot in the backward direction let me show you how to do it we'll move our right foot in the backward direction twisting our body left foot in the air I'll show it to you again right foot in the backward direction twisting our body left foot in the air now in the third step we are going to combine these two steps and we'll start with moving our right foot in the forward direction like this and now we will place our left foot on the ground and twist our body move our right foot backwards left foot in the air again after you get the hang of it it will start to look like this and now finally in the fourth step we are going to make two changes first of all we are going to increase the speed and we'll try to make sure that we should not raise our left foot too high in the air after making those two changes it will start to look like this After learning these dance moves, next we will combine it with rope jumping. Before we combine these dance moves with rope jumping, you should be able to do at least 15 single foot jumps. Now if you are able to do that, we will proceed with the first step in which we will start with the basic jumps, move our right foot forward, twist our body and perform single foot jumps keeping our left foot in the air. We will start with the basic jumps, move our right foot forward, twist our body, perform single foot jumps. Now you might have guessed the second step, in the second step we are going to move our right foot backward, twist our body, perform single foot jumps, keeping our left foot in the air. We will again start with the basic jumps, move our right foot backward and perform single foot jumps. Now the third step is going to be quite challenging because we are going to combine the early two steps. To tackle the challenge we have to create a new rhythm, so we will perform basic jumps three times then five forward twisted jumps then come back perform three basic jumps and then perform five backward twisted jumps so we'll start with the basic jumps perform it three times one two three one two three four five one two three one two three four five now after you get better at this we are going to reduce the count we are going to perform two times basic jumps three times forward twisted jumps come back perform two times basic jumps again and then three times backward twisted jumps so we'll start with the basic jumps perform it two times one two one two three one two one two three After you get the hang of it, your steps will start to look like this. Now finally in the fourth steps we are going to make two enhancements first one we are going to increase the speed and second one we'll try to make sure that our left foot is not too high in the air and it will start to look like this
might have noticed that there is also hand movement which is required to perform this jumper trick and I believe that will come naturally you just practice this jumper trick and that thing will come intuitively so guys this was the Indian step trick I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and you will try this trick as well I'll see you in the next video